There is a war going on in every grocery store refrigerator aisle across the globe. It is the battle of the milks, each one begging to come home with you, asking to be a part of your balanced diet. In this video, we discover the health benefits of the four most popular types of milk, soy, dairy, almond, and oat. After this video, you will no longer have to stand in that cold, lonely store aisle pondering which milk will satisfy all your needs as a fully functioning human being. We will see what each one can do for you and even one that could harm you. And make no mistake, four milks will enter, one milk will leave. to your fridge. It's no surprise that humans love milk. We got hooked on the stuff when we were young. Now. Here we are as adults wanting to make better health choices, but confused on the best way to do it. Everyone has different dietary needs, but there are common things all humans need for a healthy body. In this list, there is a milk that could help you achieve those healthy goals you set out for the year. Now, let's see which milk will be named the champion of all milks. We will start with Milk Classic, Dairy Milk. The original way to get strong bones and determine if Oreo cookies could float. Spoil alert, they can. Dairy milk does for bones what Adele does to our hearts. Supports it. Packed with calcium, phosphorus, vitamin D, and protein, dairy milk was designed by nature to make mammals bigger and stronger. It also has smaller amounts of B12, iodine, and magnesium that play important roles in muscle function and body homeostasis. The negative part of dairy milk is the fat. Whole milk can have as much as 8 grams of saturated fat per cup, the bad kind of fat. The number can come down if you get 1% or 2% varieties, but it should still be consumed in moderation. I know many will tell us that there is little to no fat in skim milk, but can we really consider skim milk real milk? Or is skim milk just a shadow of what milk used to be? Please convince us we are wrong in the comments. Next, we will look at soy milk. Some mean bullies started spreading rumors about soy milk a few years ago. Soy milk contains a type of plant estrogen called isoflavones. Because this is extra estrogen being introduced into the body, people once thought this would throw our hormone balance out of whack. This has since been proven to be incorrect. Soy milk does contain isoflavones, but it is an insignificant amount to negatively impact our health. But what soy milk does have is protein. Almost as much protein as dairy milk without the saturated fat along with it. The fat in soy milk is omega-3, which is the healthy kind of fat. Omega-3s have been shown to help prevent heart disease and stroke. Soy milk is often fortified with vitamins and minerals such as vitamin D. While dairy milk has natural vitamin D, soy milk needs a little help so it's added in. Some people are also allergic to dairy milk in different degrees or lactose intolerant. That makes soy milk a great alternative. Oh, almond milk. Your followers are among the most devoted and adoring of all the milk fans. They make sure to say your name loud and proud when requesting the barista add you to their morning latte. So tell us, almond milk, why do people love you so much? This nut-based dairy alternative is preferred by many because of the naturally good flavor. Even the unsweetened variety can have a fulfilling, rich taste. It has a moderate to low glycemic index, which means it won't spike blood sugar. But this depends on the brand and how much sugar is added. It is also usually fortified with vitamins A, E, and D, along with potassium and calcium. Vitamin E has been shown to promote healthy glowing skin. It is also naturally low in carbs. So when Lorraine from Accounting brags about her low-carb keto breakfast salad smoothie wrap in the morning meeting, you can sip your almond milk with the knowledge you are above that type of petty bragging. And we saved the best for last, oat milk. This milk is definitely the favorite among the four milk siblings. Sorry, soy milk. It is hard to find anything wrong with oat milk. It comes packing the most fiber of any milk. 
Most people lack enough fiber in their diets, and this can increase the risk of many health issues, including heart disease and some cancers. It also has zero saturated fats and can promote a healthy digestion. It can also make skin and nails healthier, thicker, and longer due to the vitamin B in oat milk. But just like that older sibling who is mom's favorite and can do no wrong, it's a little hard to swallow. It does not taste as good as almond or dairy milk. This can cause some companies to add in sugar or other additives to improve the taste. It also lacks the protein of other milks in the family. So here is a radical idea. Why can't we have more than one type of milk in our fridge? Maybe we can use soy milk for the overnight oats and then oat milk for our morning smoothie. Dairy milk is great after a workout and almond milk with that chocolate cake. Can we please give peace a chance? Tell us what you think in the comment section. Can your fridge be the place where diplomacy wins or will it turn into a Mad Max style fight to the finish? And if you are curious why a grandmother in Japan can bench press more than you, check out the other videos on our channel. The links are in the description. Make sure to like and subscribe to support our efforts in bringing peace to milk everywhere.